it's, there's nothing better than looking at great food photos on social media, right? And they, those who post the best photos are called food fluencers. It took that. us a bit of time. Yeah, and, and they're some of social media's most popular culinary influencers with their step-by-step -step approach to making the perfect cheese plate. Please welcome the cheese plate creator, Marissa Mullen. Yeah. Great to have you with us. in the entertainment industry for many years before yes, this. Yes, yes. This was my side hustle passion project. I love cheese. Um, I worked at the Late Show with Stephen Colbert for four years, and this was my way, you know, late Did you hours. make cheese plates for the guests? Sometimes. I did some props sometimes, yeah. But for me, you know, the late nights in TV, and it's just always so crazy. Cheese plates for me were almost this, like, therapeutic outlet. Right. Where I can, on the weekends, calm down, have natural light in my apartment, invite my Ooh. friends over, and just make a cheese plate. And it's kind of art in itself. You need to know, she's not here today, but when you go to Kelly Ripa's house, and I'm sure you will one day, she puts out a cheese plate. I mean, this is what, uh. this is her go-to when guests come over, and on the weekends, she'll text me, I just had an entire cheese plate. Yes. Because so you have to come totally back, or I'll send her the tape or maybe she's watching yes. Yes. but let's start because there's a step-by-step -step numbers process here yes. right so cheese by numbers is the method I created to create a perfect cheese plate every time um, so let's go to our stations here oh okay. stations we have stations, stations. yes yeah. so I teach cheese board workshops now in the city and uh, right. step one is always you need your board and your ramekins so we have our board we have our ramekins I say you can make a cheese what's plate a, my on what? any... what's a ramekin this is a ramekin oh. that's a ramekin I thought that was a little bowl, bowl? I call it... <laughs> it's a ramekin it's a fancy word for bowl um, but you can really make a cheese plate on any flat surface. So Just a larger yeah. ramekin? Yeah. That's a larger Large one. Ramekin. There's cheese right. in there. So okay. step one is cheese. We have three different types of cheese here. We have a fresh mozzarella, brie, and gruyere. Mm -hmm. All these you can find at the grocery store. So if you look at the map, we placed them, pre-placed them in the spots. So step two is salami. So Ooh. meat. I know what that is. We're going to make something called the salami river. Oh, and this is oh. when like it flows to the center yeah. of the plate. Oh, so like pick up your salami. The river runs so this through would be it. number. This is two. step two. Okay. okay. So we're just gonna take our salami, and I pre-folded this because we're normally I freestyle. This is much better. <laughs> yeah, this is. It's, it reminds me of adult, you know, adult coloring books. Yes, when, you, when you need to like <laughs> essentially you know, the idea. Tell us more about your pastime. <laughs> Relax, it's something that's very mind. calming and, you know, it, it adds nice texture and color. Okay. Um, so the Salami River's purpose is to separate fruits and vegetables on the plate. Ooh. So we're going to put our vegetables on the top side. So take we, your... We've got a cheese map on the website, right? Okay. Yeah. Right. So okay. you can, you can... take your tomatoes. Tomatoes. Okay. And we're just going to, if you look at the map, they're on the top right corner. Oh, okay. So I need a on. map for everything. I just realized I that enchiladas only See, had a map. It is so smart because you go number three. To me, I number mean, three. For yeah, somebody who's three not that produce. great in the kitchen, this is very right. helpful to me. Then i got to yeah. find number four. It's like a game. Yeah. So, so step one is cheese. Step two is meat. Step three is produce. So anything that's fruits and vegetables. So four. Okay, wait. Three. Four is nuts. Nuts. You guys gotta do the rest of step three. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Produce. Oh, so now oh, there's two the threes. Look, there's two threes. Uh, so so all, all of the produce. produce, so we have cucumbers, tomatoes, berries. Okay. That's all part of step three. And okay. is there a science to why? Maybe you said, is there a science to why this this order? Like, um, if I can't can I not jump the order? You can jump the order. Okay. I mean the thing with cheese plates is you can just freestyle and do whatever you want. Okay. This is just a way to give you a little guide to get you started. Okay. But a lot of things with Instagram. Everything looks very unattainable when you look at it, and this just kind of breaks it down step by step to give you that easy way to figure something simple. You don't have to cook. You don't have to really do what much number besides. What number you I'm, I'm four. I'm moving to four. Where <laughs> are you? I, I'm, I'm, are you? I'm between. Oh, shoot, you're five I, already. So guys, I'm this, somewhere in between. The, the goal is this over here, but you can do whatever you oh, want. Oh, but oh, you can, I think that you means can get. Hey, you can get what's, creative. And what's this? What are we using? What's the jam? So that's fig jam. So Ooh, fig good. jam yeah. is our step five, and then our last step is garnish. Ooh. So See, this I'm is so in. impressive because you show up with this and you're like, yeah. I know, and it, honestly, it's not hard to do. Like I've, I can do a good. I've taught no, friends who never cook ever in their lives. And what beverage do you, do you like with this? Like, what goes well? Um, well, wine and cheese, obviously. <laughs> um, also, beer and cheese, great. Beer and cheese. Yeah, they that. say that um, so champagne actually works well with cheese because the bubbles in the champagne actually scrub your palate when you eat a eat a cheese that's a little bit creamy. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, I'm on to six here. Well, I like the chemistry orange. behind the champagne and cheese now yeah. that I know. Hey, more information on Marissa, and you can download the Cheese by Numbers map if you want to use it at home. Kellyandryan.com. Great to meet you. Yeah, this great is great to meet you, too. Love it. I'm starving. We'll be right back.